All right, let's get started on this low carb homemade dog food recipe for a 15 to 20 kilogram senior dog, medium size, obviously. This is for my 15 kilogram nine year old beagle, maybe. This recipe is 100% complete and delivers the super nutrition that your dog, senior dog needs to thrive. You'll only need one supplement, but that's optional. Now, this is one day's worth of meals. So we have, and right here, you'll see a graphic with uh, the nutritional information and why we use the foods we use. 150 grams of ground pork cooked in the Instapot on the meat setting. One free range egg, two to three slices of sardines. This is one teaspoon of turmeric paste, homemade. 85 grams of vegetables. We have a half a carrot, red and yellow bell peppers, zucchini and two basil leaves these are cooked in the instapot as well on the vegetable setting to that we will add 100 milligrams of bone broth with a pinch of sea salt now this gives your dog the electrolytes they need to thrive and stay safe even in the hot weather it also has glucosamine chondroitin and most importantly collagen to help their joints feel better much stronger much more elastic and it is loaded with vitamins and minerals it is essentially a vitamin and mineral supplement next up we have chia seeds now chia seeds are a great source of calcium iron fiber and omega-3 fats but you need to soak them beforehand as you can see these are rather gelatinous when you give chia seeds dry it can pull water from the lower intestine and actually dehydrate your dog making it harder for them to go to the bathroom oh, there she is for meal time but when you soak them beforehand you won't have any problems with that and your dog will be regular and strong and healthy. And chia seeds are also a great prebiotic, which help feed this. Homemade kefir, or you can use the store-bought version, 50 milligrams of that as a probiotic. It's extra calcium, extra protein. If you want, you can add a multivitamin and electrolyte powder like this. This is multivitamin, multimineral. Anything on the bones and raw food line, this is a German brand, it's only available in Europe, but anything from there, if you just want to be extra sure that you're covering your bases, however, you do not need it, because between the vegetables and the bone broth, you will get plenty of, right, you will get plenty of vitamins and minerals, so you just mix this up and serve it, I split it in two for her, but one to three times a day is also fine. And this recipe is low carbohydrate. It's not ketogenic. If you want to make it ketogenic, you just need to add more oils, either extra virgin olive oil, grass-fed ghee or butter, uh, fish oil, coconut oil, or even uh, avocado oil. Now, to learn how to make ketogenic meals for your dog, especially if they have cancer, rheumatoid arthritis, or autoimmune disorders, just click this video right here and take a look.